Welcome again to HoustonMouse.com and uh, I'm going to show you now how to create database for our form. You need to go to your house, to your host. If you don't have one, you need to buy a host. And I'm using uh, GoDaddy. I'm already logged in. I put my username and password. Here you can see a database. You're going to MySQL. It's supposed to be the same thing in all the in all the uh, host on all the host now we're going to create a new database you need to put a description let's uh, upload uh, mysql username will be photo and the password i will put one two three four five okay ask me okay i will put, put another one and need to confirm uh, okay okay um, okay we need to choose another password uh, okay username photo already been taken because uh, somebody else uh, take it so let's take um, put another username upload Houston mouse upload Houston it's enough okay okay this is a pending setup will take a time and we will continue uh, after we have the database ready okay now we have our uh, table so we enter here we need to put a new username and password let's upload and save the same password um okay let's see um, upload Ah, okay we need to put the username that we so will be what was okay it's upload Houston so upload Houston and the password okay now we are inside you need to remember the uh, very important thing the service name your server name it's here and your password and username that you need to use it in the in the PHP file now we can go to the to create a new table let's call the table add photo and we have the name the email and the photo and id so we have four fields okay go okay the first one will be id id uh, it's unique for every customer or user so it will be uh, a number and it will be uh, auto increased alone and will be our primary key it's very important because if you put your the name or the email is the uh, unique field and two users put the same name it will be not inserted in the data so it's very important to put the ID it will be numbers one two three four and like that and the same thing its name you must put the names 
exactly how you put in the form if we go back to the form we have name email and photo and if we have to the code you see name in small letters email and photo you must put the same thing in your uh, data let's go back to our uh, table name vi uh, virtual you can uh, limit the number of the letters let's put 25 it's enough uh, not null it's uh, it's mean that it's a required field the second word is email and also let's put 25 and not nil and the last one is photo uh, you can put a text and nil because maybe some of you the users don't want to upload photo so if you leave it not nil and he didn't upload photo his database will not uh, upload it and that's it save the table and here we have the table name email and photo and our primary is the id that's it we going back to the to the dreamweaver to create our php file to insert the data here you can see it in the next tutorial thank you and see more on houstonmouse.com